Student Relations are paying bills online and you are managing payment transactions and student billing. Now what? In this Online Express Bill Pay video, we'll look at how you can review the history of your transactions and deposits. Before we get started, I do want to mention that we still recommend you run your normal student billing reports for detailed billing information. However, in Online Express Bill Pay, we provide you with the ability to quickly and easily review a history of transactions or recently committed deposits. For example, click the Transaction History button at the top of the Online Express Bill Pay page. A screen appears that lets you search for every transaction that has ever been processed. From this page, you can use the filters at the top to search for a selection of transactions or a particular transaction. Under Transaction History, you can see the payer and payment information, the student or students whom the payment was made for, the confirmation number, and a link to send the acknowledgement email again. If a parent informs you that he did not receive the acknowledgement email, click the link and a screen appears for you to review or update the email address of the recipient. After you click Send, the recent email information appends to the payer information. Now let's close the Transaction History screen and review the history of managed transactions. For recently committed deposits, you can see a summary of your recent deposits processed with FAST. Included in the table is a column for you to review your convenience fees. We listened when you told us that you didn't want convenience fees to display on student statements. Instead, here you can review a summary and then handle your fees as you see fit. For example, you can create a journal entry to handle the miscellaneous fees in General Ledger. If you want to review more information about the deposit, click the deposit number. The deposit appears for you to review billing information, make adjustments, open payments, and even drill down into a read-only view of the student's charge record. After you make any necessary adjustments to the payment record, click Save and Close to return to the deposit record. If you'd like to search for or print a list of your deposits, or find a specific deposit from the last 90 days, we can close this deposit and return to the Online Express Bill Pay page. From here, under History of Managed Transactions, click View All from Last 90 Days. A list of all committed deposits from Online Express Bill Pay appears. We chose 90 days because we recommend you reconcile at minimum quarterly, if not monthly. To send a list of all the deposits from the last 90 days to your printer, click Print. To search for a specific deposit, click Find. You can search by FAST reference number, deposit date, deposit number, payment amount, or convenience fee amount. From this screen, you can also, as before, click the deposit number to open the deposit record. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching, and be sure to check the Online Express Bill Pay How-To Documentation page for the latest help resources.